Well, I'm sitting here watching it rain. It's almost 70 degrees here today, where three or four days ago it was in the 20s. But I'd rather have 70 than 17. And the problem is it's raining. Elsewise, I would be flying. I missed a good day to fly Monday. The rain just came in late, but soon, soon. So I'm also sitting here waiting on a call from my eye surgeon scheduling nurse. I went to the eye surgeon yesterday, a follow-up from my ophthalmologist's annual visit. Uh, he decided my cataracts looked bad enough to fix. The eye surgeon verified it yesterday and said he would do the surgery. Uh, it was a pretty funny visit. My right eye is 2020, and my glasses in my right eye, as you may be able to see here, if I can stop the focus, uh, it's basically just a piece of glass. Whereas my left eye is 2060. <laughs> Uh, you can tell from the thickness of the lens on the left side, I'm blind in my left eye and my right eye, nothing. So yesterday during the testing and evaluation, everybody kept going, yeah, yeah, you got a lazy eye. And I keep going, I'm 68 years old. They didn't have anything like a lazy eye when I was growing up where they would put a patch over the good eye and make the bad eye fix itself, so to speak. But everybody, every, I went from office to office to office having tests done yesterday, and every one of them go, you know, your right eye is just perfect, but your left eye is just really bad. I know. Uh, you, they didn't treat you for lazy eye when you were young? No, they didn't. So I got in with the surgeon, and he looked at everything and said, yeah, we need to fix you up there son so he told me why i wasn't able to use the fpv goggles i've been trying for 12 to 15 years to get these cataracts fixed and it's because my left eye is 2060 and my right eye is 2020 if i have a pair of goggles that i can put my glasses on and use it's fine which the cyclops quantum cyclops I've got ready to go and we'll be trying them even before my surgery but if I take my glasses off because one eye is so much worse than the other it, it just doesn't want to focus plus for the last 12 years or so my vision has been dimming due to the clouding of the lens so uh, I just can't see stuff outside in bright daylight so the scheduling nurse is supposed to call today and schedule the surgery for about a month from now. He thinks he's about a month out on his scheduling, so that'll be near the end of March. Darn it. Be getting really warm, 1st of April. Although I'll have my vision back in 48 hours after each surgery, two weeks apart, uh, it does take two weeks to a month to get 100% vision. Now, he actually thinks I may be able to fly a week after one of the surgeries, although my vision won't be perfect. So, things are exciting there. They're finally going to fix my cataracts, and I'm finally going to be able to use FPV goggles, I'm told. So, that was exciting yesterday. Well, that's just a little tidbit of what's going on here. On the table, you'll see two new things that I got in. These are the new... TBS Crossfire Nano RX Pro. Yes, I know only 24 were made. I watched Trappy's video last night, but I got a hold of two of them. These have been telemetry tested to 40 kilometers. That's 24 miles. I don't know of anywhere around here I can fly 24 miles out and back. So these are going to be put in a nano, oops, a mini talon and a full size sky hunter I have here. Oops. Little antenna that comes with it. Ah. 
the wires cabling set with it and then if we can get it out of here here's the little tbs crossfire nano pro with 500 milliwatts a half a watt of transmit power uh, these may do everything i need i can switch from dragon link back to crossfire uh, i still haven't got the dragon link transmitter to test against my bad one but maybe that'll come someday so i'll be building up another mini talon and my other full-size sky hunter with these and we'll be testing them okay guys that's just a little tidbit here on a rainy day of what's going on here i'd like to thank everybody for all their help uh, my first drone flight was december of last year uh, just a little over two months ago and i've had five or six flights since then uh i owe that all to you guys you guys really pushed me over the top at the end and i can't tell you how much i appreciate that thank you have a good day